next time we'll be showing you how to do Muffet from Undertale's makeup look. Hi, my name's Muffet, and if you want to know how to do my look, just keep on watching. So let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my white face paint and just, I already dipped my, I already dipped my brush in the water, but you just mix it around until it's not watery. Don't get too much water on your brush or it'll become a mess. I'm just going to put on a white face paint base first and it doesn't have to be perfect because you're going to be putting a purple over it. Alright, so now that you have painted your whole face white, you are going to add some purple into it and make it look nice. Don't put too much purple on your brush because that might cause it to be too dark, unless if you have a perfectly good color of purple. And you want this to be a pretty even color so don't have different places darker than others. finished my uh, purple face paint I'm going to do some contouring and I have a light purple which I'm going to be using as my highlight and a dark purple for my jawline and other places that I'm going to need it so I'm going to start with the dark and I'm going to use this brush and I'm going to put this in the hollows of my cheekbones So now that I have finished the dark contouring, I'm going to go into my highlight and put it on my nose, my top cheekbones, and up here. on the contouring I'm going to move on to the blush and I'm just going to put on some light pink blush and I don't want too much of it I'm just going to do it lightly on my cheekbones the apples of my cheek now that I have finished all of that the main stuff I'm going to move on to her spider eyes that she has all over her forehead and on her eyes. Okay, so uh, now it is time for the black and I need my dad to come in and outline it and to get it symmetrical since I can't really do that right here because that's like impossible. I don't know. I, it'll look more symmetrical and he'll outline them and I'll color them in and I'll do the middle eye. My dad has outlined the eyeballs. I am going to color them in with this brush. I'm going to touch this up later, but while I'm waiting for all this to dry, I'm going to take my mascara and just use it as if you would normal mascara. Once the black dries, I'm going to go back in and define the points and edges. Dad is going to come in and help me to find the edges and points because I might mess it up and have to redo all of it. So now that Daddy has done the eyeballs, he has fixed them up a bit, I am going to draw some fangs on the lips because she has spider-like fangs. And then after I've done the spider fangs, I am going to put on my black lip gloss. Something you guys watching this 
may not know who Muffet is, and she's a spider character from uh, from the game Undertale, and she she attacks you for not buying stuff from her bake sale, and also because she thinks you're killing spiders. So now that I have finished my fangs, I'm going to move on to the lip gloss lipstick. This is a really, really dark purple, and it's almost a black, but it still has a hint of purple in it. So, uh, things got a little bit messed up while we were doing the lipstick, but we fixed it all up. As you can see, the fangs have changed. Probably some of the color on the face has changed. We had a, we had a mishap, so we had to do a bunch of stuff. But, now that the makeup is done, and it's time for me to go put on my wig and the gloves. My hands have to be purple, and I'll be right back. Why so pale? You should be proud. Proud that you're going to make a delicious cake. Oh! All right, so this concludes the look. I have my teapots. I don't have a spider donut, but I have spider cobwebs. I never talked about the background, but I have the echo flower from the mysterious place and the stars. And with this whole outfit and all this stuff, since I'm gonna be here for Halloween probably, I have cute shorts to go with it. It's adorable. So that is it for this makeup video. Thank you for watching. Please comment, share, subscribe, thumbs up, follow us on Twitter, and bye Jimmy.